kani gade ka patisi tv bat fidang pet yaki khubor baman kasni hanne kasni ka arp south trek mtau nailor arja khatpra kino hilam jong kaseng meghalaya pradesh congress committee gila pansa pai ba halor ka jingmi no unong yalam barem jong kaseng congress u dr didi lapang nakani kaseng habai kran merkinong phai khubor ha congress bhavan u president jong ka meghalaya pradesh congress committee u dr celestine lingdo ulapan pau ba nakani jong kaseng congress kasno kandet ek jingmi no jong ni urat ba kaseng haki kandet singi ki balalen kaseng congress kalapan pau ba kalapadyang yakni ke jingi no jong ni urang ba bat ka kerku kerdo ru yo dr didi lapang ba undang sait nang khlain bat ba undang la ban trai na ka ban ta ki pai ba jong ka jilla haki singi ki ban nang wan hakni ke singi lai don tang ka ru ki wei de ki rai urang ba jong ka sang congress ba kan thop yo ba a h scott ling do u ba kennedy cream bat ki wei ki wei de ki nong ilam has given that senior leaders are being forced out. That word actually is incorrect. What our AICC president, Rahul Ji, is saying is the Congress party will create space and give opportunity to younger leaders to get into the activities of the party and learn. He has never said that senior leaders will be placed out. While saying that, Dr. Lopang has mentioned as examples, he, gave, he took the name of Srimati Ambika Soni, that she was face out. In fact, that is not true. Ambika Soni is still the General Secretary of ICC. She is a member in the CWC, Congress Working Committee, and she is in charge for Jammu and Kashmir. And for Sri Kamal Nath he is the President of the Madhya Pradesh Congress Committee. Janardhan Divedi, he is a member of the Central Election Committee. Sushil Kumar Shinde, he is a member of the AICC in the Disciplinary Committee. Digvijay Singh, he is a member of the Election Coordination Committee. And Sri Oscar Fernandez is a member of the Central Election Committee. So the allegations that senior leaders are being forced out holds no water. Every senior member in the party is given a right place as mentors, as guides, and the party respects them. Now, for me personally, I am also from Rinpoche district. I have the highest respect for Dr. Didalapa. <coughs> In Rinpoche, we call him Upa Jongkari. Until now, my respects has never been lesser. I hold him in high esteem. Every decision that he took, I used to respect them. But unfortunately, for this last decision that he took, to quit the Congress party, it has come as a shock even to me. In fact, on the 12th of September, we were together for a meeting in Rivoy district. We were in the same meeting. He never gave any indication that he will be leaving the party. So now that he left, the only thing I could say is, we wish him well. In the name of the Congress Party and PCC, we wish him well, we wish him good health and all his future endeavors. He has mentioned that he will not join electoral politics, but he will be actively involved with politics. So we wish him well. We wish that he can still contribute for the benefit of the people in the state.